Look at this, everybody. Here comes a lioness. She spotted a straggler behind the herd, and I don't think I can move. I'm going to. I think the straggler is going to pop out into the grass. You got the straggler there. He's just through the grass there. And everybody on Facebook, that straggling wildebeest is about to be pounced upon by a lioness who's not far away. We're just not in the best possible position. She's there. She spotted him. I'm going to try and move very slightly forward. She's, I think he's injured or sick. You want to be happy here, Ferg? Okay, Fergus says he's got a decent shot from here. She's been stalking this herd now for about five minutes. Most of them have moved up onto the hill next to us, and she spotted that thing. is either sick or injured. Here she goes. She's running. I don't think that thing has any idea what's going on. He's just kind of limping along. She's only about 30 meters from him now, using the contours of the road. Let's sit still, everybody. That's me who Fergus is shouting at. There, look. Here she goes. Probably sick from all the walking, might be very old. Has no idea what's going on. She's, look how she uses the contour of the road here. And every time it looks like it's gonna turn around, she stops. It's very shortly now that she's gonna make the rush. I hope that we can see it. We can just see the wildebeest, there she goes. Oh, are we gonna see it? She can't be more. There, she's on his back. She's on his back. That's a big wildebeest. She's a lioness in her prime, fully fed, beautifully fed. By all the migration meals, she's a powerful, powerful animal. 120 kilograms, 260 pounds. She's just taken down what looks to be a very sickly wildebeest calf, weighing probably twice what she does. It's not over yet. I'm sorry we can't move any closer. I think we'll probably lose a signal. Well, that's the takedown. Let's move a little bit closer. Ferg, sorry, man. There we go. 